Yo, what's good guys? It's Nightwing2303 from Wartesters.com. Got a really epic or special pickup in the day, and that is one of my favorite shoes of all time, the Jordan Team 2. And this is the best colorway, hands down, of the shoe. I don't care what anybody says. This right here, this is the shoe. So for any of you guys that weren't around back in the day, I think it was like 1998, this was the second rendition of the Team Jordan shoe. And Team Jordan members were not only just like NBA athletes like Ray Allen, uh, Vin Baker, man, who else was there? Darius Miles, Quentin Richardson, you know what I mean? Like we're talking like the first edition, Eddie Jones was there. So not only did those players wear this, but the team shoes were also meant for the collegiate games. So you had UNC rocking them, Cincinnati Bearcats, Cincinnati actually rocked these ones. And these were designated for the Cal Bears. And for whatever reason, I always liked the black and red colorways, but back then the blue colorways of the shoes were always just unique, you know what I mean? Like the Flint 13s, stuff like that. So it was always like a different look on a Jordan because you'd, you'd always expect black and red. It was Chicago, he was a bull, you know what I mean? Like that was that. So Obsidian 12s, Flint 13s, these guys right here, they were just something different and I always loved it and I always gravitated towards the slightly different release in addition to the classic ones that I clearly love also. So again, these things are just like the other ones that I showcased. I made a video on them already. Um, I love the two-tone look. I like the, the split, the, the half blue, the half white. I think it's great. The blue the blue piping is, is amazing. Can't go wrong with that patch either. That thing was dope back in the day and I think it's just as dope now. As far as the materials go, uh, the, the leather that they use is a synthetic, but it's it's a nice one except for on the toe It doesn't feel as nice. It's just kind of stiff and hard That's what she said But they did use a nicer new book material on the side panel here And then the leather on this panel right here is pretty nice as well And it's also nicely padded so you can feel it not as much padding on the interior I love the shield logo right there with the blue and the yellow it's just a different look and then same thing here with the team Jordan with the yellow stripes Super clean, carbon fiber, herringbone traction, can't go wrong. These are ultra comfortable, by the way. You have a heel and forefoot zoom unit. And I have hooped in these, not these ones. I hooped in these ones a little bit, and they were legit, just like they were back in the day. Great traction, great cushion. They feel awesome. Plenty of stability as well. But if you're looking for a solid hoop shoe that doesn't break the bank, and it's got a classic look, but you're not playing in the retros that you really want to rock casually, this is a go-to shoe. This should be in your gym bag if that's the look you're looking for. And if you're just looking for performance, they're not that bad in that department either. So that pretty much takes care of it. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all your support. Let me know what you guys think about these. Do you like them? Do you hate them? I think last time most of you guys said that you didn't like them. But what about this colorway? I mean, they're a little cleaner looking, right? Right? So thank you guys again, and until next time, have a good one.